this morning when we met all the partners who are actively involved on climate issues in, in Africa, um, ICLE, UCLG, GCOM, C40 cities, the males um, who are serving on the boards of all these institutions and the rest. Um, there was a need for us to merge and have one body that is leading the African um, on climate issues. I mean, climate change is real, the data is very clear, the scientists have spoken, and its impact on us is more global. But the issues are done more locally. So we're calling on everybody, all local authorities, to step up action so that collectively and comprehensively our action should lead to the mitigation and adaptation that we are all seeking for. Well, I think that, uh, first of all, the such a congress is very important because it becomes the platform for us to share ideas and uh, share experiences as well. So the talking is, is important and people also acquire a lot of knowledge. But more importantly, as we agreed on the action points, it should also serve as a platform to assess what we have done over the period and understand where we are now as we gather momentum to uh, working towards the meeting our uh, Paris uh, agreement. Well, I think that uh, Africa is, uh, the impact of climate change in Africa, it's becoming more real and, more, and having a tone on arts. There's a need for us also to invest on issues of climate change and also consider our development through the spectacle of the environment, through the spectacle of sustainability, so that we will appreciate the fact that climate change actions are development matters and that there is no distinction between the two and that will also help us and equally calling on the um, other continents especially the west to invest in africa because africa's contribution to climate change is just about four percent and yet because our cities and national government are not resilient enough, we face the consequences and that we are calling on those who pollute more to contribute more so that we can deal with the issue.